as a father, I see the damage that my generation and the generations before me have done to our planet. I want to make sure that the planet that I leave my little people and their little people hopefully will be in a better position than the one that I find my planet in now. The volume of plastic that we've generated now has seen our landfills basically at critical to the point now where there is actually nowhere else for it to go. Certainly plastic, as we, as we all very well know, does not just disappear, it has to go somewhere and at the moment we're seeing that overflow fall into our waterways, into our oceans, becoming more and more apparent and therefore it's, it's, it's at a critical stage now where we quite simply have to stop using so much plastic or we have to find a purpose for the plastic that's already been made. As a brand, we are unbelievably passionate about the environment. We are passionate about leading the way in our particular industry of teamwear and uniforms because this has a history of being quite a frivolous and cheap industry. And we believe that we can bring sustainability and quality into that field by demonstrating and putting in place the practices that we do have, that we are leading the way in educating not only our consumers, but also our competition. Quality plays a major part in sustainability. And the durability of a product reduces the amount of products we have to make. We are seeking to be the absolute opposite of fast fashion. We want to be something that is reused, which is cared about, which is loved. Otherwise, we're only adding to the problem by producing more additional waste, but in the form of, of textiles. So what we deem as waste will be taken, broken down, and actually put into different new materials. For instance, the main body of a plastic bottle will be used in producing our yarn, whereas the caps of the bottles will actually be used in making toys, various different plastics also used in making x-ray film, things like that, and that all comes from recycling plastics. I think it's really important that people recognise that um, manufacturing fabrics using recycled PET at no point does it affect the quality or function of those fabrics. In fact, at times we are now producing better quality, more functional fabrics by utilising recycled PET, PET than we are by using virgin yarn. And I think that's really important for us as a brand because we are customising our fabrics. It means that we are actually producing fabrics that are very specific to our consumer needs. We're in fact able to dictate a weight of a yarn and that in turn allows, gives us the, the flexibility to create products that suit the sport or the need of the consumer. For the instance of rugby, having a 200 pound man grab hold of you and being dragged behind you requires something of a lot more density and durability. Where something like cycling, we're looking for a lighter fabric that's more breathable. And all this can be found by using recycled PET. Our suppliers are more like partners. We've grown as a brand as they've grown as a factory. Both of our key suppliers um, have grown with our belief and values with regards to sustainability, which is supported in the way that they've set up the factory for us to achieve what we want to achieve as a brand. They're also key to bring new innovative ideas to us with regards to manufacturing, which is always very exciting. It's what they specialize in and allow us to focus on our side of the business with regards to product development, fabrics, and so forth. Our goal with our eco line is hopefully to become a market leader. We desperately want our industry to take note. We also think we have a role to play with regard to education and that's why we work very closely with a lot of schools and corporates. Schools particularly are exciting because we have these untarnished minds that have new fresh ideas who are open. It's also going to be their future planet um, and I think they're becoming more and more knowledgeable with regards to the behaviours that they have as consumers. What I find brilliant about going to schools and designing with kids is the ideas that they come up with. Uh, it excites me about what they bring to the table, stuff that I, I've not thought about, stuff that maybe as a company we haven't thought about. So to get fresh young eyes on this, on this stuff is, is really great. I 
as a school, as an organisation, we need to connect with other organisations that have good environmental initiatives and, and good environmental outlooks. Often you do recycling uh, projects and the students stop at the point where they've collected the items for recycling. Tsunami Sports took us much further forward. They were able to find out what was going to happen with those items. It was explained to them about how that product would be recycled and then be able to be repurposed and reused as a new product. It's important not only that we teach the children about and, and for the environment, but it's important that we relate it to what we're doing and what we're buying. And it's also important in terms of bringing people in who actually live and breathe sustainability. Every kid here has, uh, has to take PE, and so they all have these PE uniforms. And even a small thing like the fact that they're aware that their PE uniforms are, are made from recycled plastic, kids will stop and think and, 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 and we realize that, wow, that's, that's actually really cool. Often with environmental issues, we, we get tied up with what is negative and what is bad and what we need to fix and what we need to change in our lives. Um, whereas this is something that is a very positive move forward. We'd like the, the students perhaps to be the sustainability pioneers of the future. But if they're not, we just want them to be you know, citizens that have got sustainability at their hearts or businessmen and women who sustainability isn't a bolt-on, it's something that's absolutely the centre of their business. For Kellett School to turn towards more eco-friendly products, it sets our students on a path of doing that throughout their lives. So it's about educating our students on the right behaviours and making sure that they understand the reasoning behind that and then it becomes a lifelong habit. As a school, we didn't really know a great deal about recycled fabrics. So this has been a, a, a massive step forward for the school in terms of our awareness about what is possible. And it's been, been excellent, not just for the students to learn about the possibilities of recycled fabrics, but for us as an organisation to find out about that. The future is really exciting for us because we know of all the innovations and ideas that we have and things that we're looking to adopt moving forward. We're excited by developments in our production, we're excited by developments in our product, um, but most importantly we're really excited by the mindset change that we're seeing in consumers. People are coming to us asking for sustainable solutions to their uniforms, to their sports kits, and for me that's a significant change. Five or six years ago, no one ever came to us. No one really took an interest in what we were doing from a sustainability or environmental point of view. And now it's why people are coming to see us. And for me, that's really exciting because ultimately that was about changing a mindset. And we want to be the leaders in that. And the fact that these discussions are now taking place tells me that we're doing something right. And therefore, I'm full of optimism and excited to what we hold as a brand in the future.